The Guantanamo Bay Detention Camp is a United States military prison on the shores of Cuba. There are an estimated 355 people detained at Guantanamo Bay. Habeas Corpus, the right to seek relief from unlawful detention, was suspended for unlawful enemy combatants by the Military Commissions Act of 2006. Under this act, people declared unlawful enemy combatants can be detained in Guantanamo Bay or other military prisons for indefinite periods of time without knowing their charges or having access to legal counsel or a trial. There has been controversy regarding human rights abuses in violation of international law. According to recent FBI reports, Captives at Guantanamo Bay were chained in a fetal position for 18 hours or more without access to toilets. Other techniques include exposure to extreme temperatures, constant blaring music, and 24-7 exposure to bright lights. Another important element of Guantanamo Bay interrogation techniques is the desecration of religion. There are several recorded instances of Muslim holy texts being ripped, stomped on, and or urinated on. Some people have a distorted view of Guantanamo Bay. <laughs> I'm glad they're at Guantanamo. I don't want them on our soil. I want them in Guantanamo when they don't get the access to lawyers they get when they're on our soil. I don't want them in, in our prisons. I want them there. Some people have said we had to close Guantanamo. My view is we had a double Guantanamo. We had to make sure that the terrorists... If these are terrorists, why should we care? It is a common misconception that detainees at Guantanamo Bay are all terrorists. In fact, since they can be held without formal charges, they are often wrongly accused. It's important to remember that even Nazi war criminals were allowed fair trial. President Bush, set a precedent for justice, not torture, in America. Close Guantanamo Bay!